In today's Get Dirty segment, we're talking about a plant that attracts butterflies. Michelle Harmon, Community Relations Specialist at the Board of Water Supply, joins us this morning with more on that as well as what's happening at the Board of Water Supply. Good morning. Good morning. Thank you so much for having me. Of course. Thanks for joining us. I mean, we always talk about, you know, all the great things that are happening at the Board of Water Supply. So what's happening this month? Um, so, of course, we have lots of great workshops, really fun workshops on November 2nd and November 9th. We have a two part workshop and participants are going to make something like this. It's a recycled cabinet garden nook and so that's our one from the garden. Um, we have succulents and herbs in that one and they have to attend both parts. So on the first part they're going to prep it and paint it. On the second part they're going to finish painting and then um, seal it. Okay and can we take a camera shot of this one? I'm not sure if we can grab it. There we go. So this is what you're talking about. There's yes. some pictures but this yeah. is what you can make. Yeah isn't How it cool? cute? <laughs> Very cute. Yeah. So what, I mean, what, what does this all entail? Oh, um, well, it's one of our more complex workshops. It so, seems like Yeah, that. but it's super fun and everybody can do it. Um, and our website has more details and information on how to register. Um, so we have that workshop, which is, again, a two-part workshop. Okay. And then on the 16th, we have Master Gardener Joanne Maeda, and she's going to be talking about how to create a Zurich Butterfly garden. Oh, very yeah. neat. Of course, all the xeric plants we've been talking about yeah. so great because yeah. they help you save water, save mm -hmm. money. Mm -hmm. Very cool. Um, and then, what about this one right here? Oh, so um, this. These are two native plants. This is a little koa and a mamaki, and our native um, Kamehameha butterfly really loves these plants. So sometimes butterflies and caterpillars have different plant needs. Um, so the adult really likes the sap and the nectar from the flowers of the koa, and the caterpillars really like the little mamaki um, leaves and relatives of the mamaki. So cute. So yeah, our workshop is going to help people learn about a few different butterflies, and then also the caterpillar and what their plant needs are. Oh, very yeah. neat. Okay, and then speaking of, you guys also, of course, do your Zurich seed. Yes. Yeah. What is that this month? Oh, so of course, um, for November and then for part of December, we're going to be having this beautiful coral plant. Oh, so butterflies so are often attracted to brightly colored flowers, so this orange is perfect for them, and it has um, a really sturdy um, um, flower pad yeah. where they can uh, land and then get the nectar that they need. So again, we're going to be giving seeds away for this plant and it'll be all of November and part of December. And if people are interested, they can check our website for more information. So beautiful. Okay, yeah. so a lot of workshops yes. happening. Yeah. For, for more information, uh, what is that website, just in case those who um, don't know? Um, so the best thing to do is to Google Board of Water Supply okay. and then workshops, and it should pop up because it's a really long address. Okay. Yeah. And then we'll have a link to that on our website <laughs> yeah. as well at k20.com, so make sure you check that out. Very cool. And now you guys also are doing something about all parts are poisonous? What is oh, that? Oh, yes. Um, so a lot of xeric plants, uh, they have a little bit of sap in them that are toxic. Oh. Yeah. So I just actually read a study that... Um, Nobody should be eating this plant, but it takes a little while to take effect. But yeah, nobody wants uh -uh. to be breaking off or eating this plant. So mamaki, on the other hand, is a medicinal um, plant, and so a lot of people make tea out of it. But definitely the coral plant, nobody should be breaking them, rubbing okay. the sap on them, or eating them, or making tea out of them. Okay, no, luckily <laughs> yeah. I wasn't planning to do that. And I mean, that's, that's different information that you can learn at all the different workshops. Yes, I mean, you, sure. you guys are so, I mean, you just have so much knowledge on so many different things, of course, when it comes to plants, but even when it comes to cute yeah, projects, yeah. butterflies, insects, yeah. super cool. So make sure you check out the Board of Water Supply. Yeah. Thank you so much for Thank joining for us this morning. Me. And again, okay. we'll have the link to our uh, their workshops on our website, k2n2.com, and you're going to want to sign up. Do you happen to know how much this one costs to attend? Uh, I think it's $25 um, for the first one. Not bad. Yeah, yeah. I mean, when it comes to the supplies, all right. And, right. and all the pricing, too, is going to be on their website as yes, well. For all sure. right. Thank you for okay. joining us. Okay. Thank you so much.